Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. In today's episode, I'm gonna show you how to revoke permissions with MetaMask. Let's begin. So, why do you revoke permissions? Well, first of all, um, you know, revoking permissions. So we're talking about cryptocurrency. We're talking about smart contract. So, um, smart contract revocation is sometimes applicable when you feel like, you know, um, you're not safe or there's like malicious developers or you're connected to a certain contract and you feel like, you know, this is not legit or it's a scam or it's a fraud. So there's a way for you to actually revoke um, your permission for this contract to your wallet. So there are a lot of, um, partners and or sites wherein you can actually do this so i'm just going to show you one example here in metamask so going back um what you need to do is go to your browser um i would show i would choose and um, revoke this is one of the most popular um site wherein you could actually you know revoke um permissions so what you're gonna do is make sure your wallet is this uh your wallet is connected okay and um say if i so if you could see here it's pretty much you know it's pretty straightforward um you know it would tell you which particular contract or a token that you need to revoke so say for instance i would want to revoke Goat. just click on revoke and take note that if you're going to do this guys there's going to be like gas fees associated with it if you just need to click on approve then you know you would be able to revoke your permission or you can just, uh, just simply reject so there's tons of ways that you can do that. You can either do that in Etherscan or, you know, BSE scan. But for me, this is my most, um, you know, user-friendly um, site wherein I can do that. So I hope you learned something today. If you want to learn more about cryptocurrency, please subscribe to our channel and leave a like. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.